I am indeed a Bishma. Okay. Um, uh, in actual fact, I, I was born, I experienced the poverty. I've seen poverty in its naked form. Mm. I even experienced the lies, you know lies. Mm. As you can see my feet, I could really put on shoes. Mm. I, would, I would walk barefooted to school, even on, in winter. Mm. But I pushed on through and learned it, and learned it, until I achieved certain uh, uh, hierarchy in, 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 in educational uh, background. Mm. Uh, as I was growing up around uh, Ngamiland here, I, I, I saw my people suffering. I discovered that they were the most disadvantaged group of community of all the tribes. Mm. And I was wondering as I was learning more, reading more and more books, that there were only uh, eight tribes constitutionally that were mentioned in the Botswana constitution. I wondered why we were not mentioned. Hence, we were the natives, the, the indigenous people, the original people here. My father used to tell me that, never forget, and never forget that you are a Bushman, you are the son of the sun, mm. and that will never change, nothing can change you from that. Place. And my mother, my father would, would never call me with my name, mm. and he would say, the Bushman, Masarwa. Every time he would call me, Masarwa, and he said, never, and never forget that you are the son of the sun. You should go to school and learn and learn more and be very educated and then and then and then you will marry a, a, maybe you'll marry a, and learn english you must learn more english maybe you'll marry a white lady like sister as a cow and that encouragement alone as i was a young boy i read a lot of books and i learned a lot of english so that maybe i was going to marry a white woman as a boy i have seen them suffering living in poverty and that pained me a lot indeed that pained me a lot we were living in handouts all the things that I can mention I'm, I'm afraid okay. from, from what you are saying I can see you have a distrust of the world around you but now because you have met the Holy Spirit how are you feeling? well I'm, I'm feeling much relieved mm. it was just like I was carried all along I've been carried heavy burden, mm. the pain in my soul, the pain in my heart, the pain in my mind about my people, mm. who I learned that they are the original people and they don't even enjoy, we don't even enjoy the wealth of this country. Mm. We, are not, we are not recognized. Mm. We are always left in the cold. Mm. When the constitution was, 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 was written, we were never consulted. The land has been divided into ranches and given to the, to the rich people, white people. Mm. Now we are made to be, hunt, to be, to be, um, we were are, we are made to be head boys of those cattle. Okay. We are looking after their cattle okay. and only paid with the tobacco mm. and the palaji and a bit of sugar. Mm. And this, all these things I've been watching, my uncles, used to work for the boos in the ranches, in mm. Khansi. The Khansi, the, the, I was, I'm, I'm still asking myself, the Khansi land was divided and given to the boos from South Africa, most of them. Mm. And we never considered the Bushmen. Mm. And we never even left nothing, no, not even a piece of land to stay that we can call our, 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 ours. Okay. And these things have been haunting me and haunting me. So how do you feel? Well, I, I, I feel now, I, 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 you see, let me say, uh, how can I describe it? I feel that, like I am in that city called Heaven. Okay. Okay. My great prophecy is to visit to find the truth. Yeah. I'm so relieved. Okay. I, I'm a very scrutinous man when it comes to religion. Yeah. Most of the churches that invited me, that I attended, did, did not even go to my soul, capture my soul. Yeah. It is only this church that captured my soul. And my wife was wondering, because he always, he always chased me around, let's go to the church. Different churches, fire churches, that's you see. And I will drag my feet, just like this. It is only this one. Why, do, in, but, why this one? But ever since I visited this church, I could see things changing for the first time in my life, mm. where I had to receive instructions from a church like this one. And I was telling my wife that now I am going to pray with the Zazurus. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to pray. I was supposed to go to Isape 
Okay. And I had money for that. Unfortunately, there was uh, a, a young man next to me to my house, my home, passed away, drowned in the water. Okay. I who, who was representing us in the Hague, okay. the National Court of Justice, Royce Sun, the famous Royce Sun, you might know him. Uh, who I was fighting? Him we, 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 you heard that he was the one who who was fighting our, 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 our rights to be chased out of the Central Kalahari Game Reserve, CKGR. Okay. He was our representative. Yeah. Royce Sana. Okay. Royce Sana comes from the group of the Bushmen called the Ganaku. Okay. That is where my father comes from. My yeah. father comes from the Ganaku group of, 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 of people, of yeah. the Bushmen. Yeah. We are divided into tribes and, uh, and clans. Okay. We differ, sometimes we differ in societal values, but right. yet and we differ with languages. Right. We speak different languages, but our traditions, our concepts, our ambitions and our ambitions are the same. Are the same. Yeah. In our language, we have more than 20 languages, different languages here. Okay. Yeah. Like I was telling you before, that my, my father comes from Kanaku, yeah. Clare, and yeah. my mother comes from the Kaku, yeah. They are the Bushmen. They are divided. My father comes from the Sand Belt. Okay. And my mother comes from the Delta, yeah. from the river. In the Sand Belt, people are ready, short and with kinky, as you can see my king. Okay. It's, it's like they, 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 they age up, the wrinkles develop very early in life. Yeah. You can see he's, elder. he's, he's, he's an elder from Nigeria. Yeah. But in my face, I've got more wrinkles. More wrinkles, okay. I, 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 I don't grey area. Okay. I'm 56 years old, 55, 55. Yeah. But the hair, the grey hairs that come, even the body. Yeah. But the young people, 10 years difference from me, they're bald. That's how good we are. We really develop beard, big beard like this. Yeah. It was, it, I was supposed to have started school in 1969. Okay. I was very sure. They used, when I, whenever I come to school for registration, they, they say, touch the touch I wouldn't touch it. Yeah, Later on, my, my mother went to the school and said, listen, this person is a bushman. We will remain short like that until after 10 years. I went to school at the age of 10. Mm. In 1973, you were a year old.